What's up and welcome back everyone and thank you again for joining me on this problem. So let's start by observing the diagrams below that show two pairs of shapes representing fractions. <laughs> and for each of those separate diagrams, we want to shade in the second shape to make each pair represent equivalent fractions. So in other words, we have to color in each figure on the right side of the diagram to make it an equivalent fraction to the figure on the left side of the diagram. So let's start with the first diagram on the left. We can see that out of the six regions, four of them are shaded in, in that nice pink color. So we have to make an equivalent shaded area on the other figure. And we can do that by shading in two of those three sections. Again, we see that they are equivalent in how much they are shaded in. So our first diagram represented four of six, and our second was two of three. And we can say that four over six and two over three are equivalent fractions. <laughs> cool. And this is true no matter how you shaded in that second image, as long as you shaded in two of the three regions. So now let's go ahead and take a look at the second diagram in blue. Now for this one, we notice that the first figure is half shaded in, two of the four sections. So if we slide that region over, we just want to align it so that two full sections are shaded in. And again, we can see here that each of these diagrams represent one half. And this applies to no matter how we shade it in, as long as we shade in two of the four sections. So again, we can say that two over four is equivalent to two over four because they both represent one half. And that's it for that one. So hopefully this helps you to better visualize and understand fractions. We like to think about them this way because they are easier to wrap your head around. And thank you guys again for stopping by. We'll see you all next time. <laughs> all right, so that's it for that lesson. Hope you found it helpful. And if you did, please click that link below and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We add new lessons every week. We don't want you to miss out. And also, if you have any questions or concerns, Feel free to comment down in the comment section below. We respond to every single comment. I promise you will respond, even the mean ones. Okay, but let's just try to keep it nice. Those ones are always a lot more fun to read. And uh, we'll catch you guys next time. See ya.